Welcome back fellow travelers. I am the Traveling Sam and in this video I'm going to take you on my trip to visit three waterfalls on the Columbia River Gorge. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any more trips or eats that I do along the way. The very first thing I should mention, if you're visiting Portland for the waterfalls, you will need a permit if you're coming between May through September. I was lucky that I visited in October, so you don't need a permit during this time. The first waterfall we visited was Waikina Falls, and it's the closest to Multnomah Falls. Parking is very easy, very simple, it's right in front. So we made it to Waikina Falls. It is a much smaller waterfall, but we're going along the coast and it's so beautiful and it's a nice day out. So when you visit, I think right here on this ledge is the perfect place you can take a photo of. I took several and the pictures were just amazing and it's a really nice peaceful place that you can listen to the sounds of the river. I'm in this beautiful forest. We're just gonna drive around the coast and see a couple more and once we're done, it's back to Portland, Oregon for us to stay there. Um, if you're able to come over and experience these beautiful waterfalls, I was lucky enough to catch them when it's sunny out, when there's no rain. I do have my raincoat on because I did think we needed it, but we didn't. <laughs> um, yeah. So yeah, on to the next one. The next waterfall on the trail is called Horsetail Falls. And in this one, there is limited parking, but it's not as crowded most days, I guess. But when you get there, you can get up close with this waterfall. It is very much bigger than the previous one, so you will get splashed, you, there will be drizzle. Um, I think this was the most I ever got rained on. I really loved the stone stairway and it was a perfect opportunity to take pictures with the waterfall in the background. A waterfall journey and as you can see behind me and hear it it's beautiful I am loving all of this nature and rain and waterfalls it's amazing I love it let me show you the background. So this is Horse Tail Falls. It's just a ways past Malahula Falls. And I'm just so happy to be on this quick drive through Oregon waterfalls. We were lucky that it's only slightly drizzling. So you can take pictures and walk around and not have to worry about having full on drench, but it's nice out and I'm loving it and it's so beautiful. Ah! I can't wait to continue on on this trip. Now we saved the best for last. We wanted to do Mont Numa Falls and just enjoy the rest of the time we had there. 
Parking right in front of the waterfalls is tricky because there's very limited parking, but as you can see, they have parking across the highway. And I'm gonna show you how to get from where you park in the highway. And it's a really short walk and it's really safe, I promise you. You never have to go anywhere near that scary highway. You go under this passageway and it takes you directly to the waterfall entrance. It's very easy. It's a five minute walk and it's really beautiful. The best part of this location is that there is a restaurant on site. There's also a gift shop available. There's a coffee stand and there are restrooms for the public to use. So there is everything you could want before you head out and continue on the highway, which is perfect. This is the coffee line, by the way. So seeing Multnomah Falls for the first time in my life, I was left very awestruck. It's very majestic. It reminded me of what Riverdale from The Lord of the Rings might look like in real life or take inspiration from. Um, if I could, I would love to stay here longer because it's just such a beautiful sight to behold. Depending on how large the crowds are, just be patient and you'll be able to get a photo in front of this waterfall and get your picture perfect Instagram shot, I promise. So we just went to Maluna Falls and we are now on our way to Portland. So I'm very happy that it was such a nice and sunny day. I'm so happy that we got sunshine and we were able to see the waterfalls. They were so beautiful. As you can see behind me, it's like right there. Um, yeah, so if you get a chance to come out and see waterfalls in Oregon, they're beautiful. And now we're on to Portland.